could let our tears keep our secrets. But instead, we post billboards the same thoughts we would only share with a therapist. This year's show came about. Uh, we were having a meeting, and um, we had a series normally during our meetings we perform poems like it's just a time for us to kind of sit down and share with each other and one of our meetings they all the poems kind of took a turn for you know the after dark variety and uh, so basically we kind of realized we have a lot of material about you know stuff that you're not supposed to be talking about and so uh, basically what ended up happening was we decided hey we should just have a show where we just sit up and talk about all the things that we normally can't talk about, the things that really make people uncomfortable. I hope you don't think that means you're getting any tonight, because then you have to think twice. Ooh. And again, because I'm going to need my mentality to turn you on and my aspirations to make you stronger. Yeah. One thing that's really special about this year's show is we're being really, really vulnerable and really open. Um, so this year's topic was um, after dark um, taboo topics. And so we're talking about a lot of things that are kind of sensitive to a lot of people. And so I feel like everyone can get something um, out of the show. I want to be like Mike Vic. Not to say he wasn't sick for his transgressions, but I'm trying to understand the difference between a damn lesson and a crucifixion. Listen, it's like this. Um, I think we have a really good group of people and everyone brings something different to the table. There's a lot of talent, but also a lot of diversity of thought and of poetry. All the time when I'm alone, standing naked, costume lying on the floor, I just know that this can't be my body, nothing but dissonance ringing at my core, and I just wish that I wouldn't have to live this life anymore. Hold your head up, boy. We're too noble to cry. Because despite my way with words, he doesn't want to hear that from me. How old were you? How old were you, men? How old were you when you stopped crying? What's unique about this year's show is uh, we have an awful lot of new people, a lot of new voices, a lot of fresh faces, and I think they bring a really interesting perspective to our show. They uh, provide different kind of perspectives and things like that, and so I think that's kind of what makes it really unique is that it's not the same, you know, veterans that are coming through and saying the same stuff, you know, not to say that we're tired because we never are, we never are, we got good material all the time, but we have new people this time around and um, they're really good, they're really original and it's good to have, you know, fresh faces, so.